And Monty, you know, you may have gotten me to do something because I have never set up my camera to film except to do this video for you just now. And now I know that I can do this. I might turn into a YouTube star. So here goes. Um, this is the Hasina 2. You've seen. I showed you the picture. And I'm just going to swatch them, you know. I'll start with the greens. Ooh, this is Mahia. Let's see what we can do here. Oh, shit. Wow. Holy moly. Goodness. Okay. This is Aaron. Very, very similar. Um... A little bit darker and a little more blue in it, but still very much a rich green. This is Re. Um, also, so this one is a little more, ow, that's so weird. Um, on camera, it looks more blue, but it is definitely green in person. And when you look at them in person, side by side, well, they look similar, but they're very different. Um, uh, yeah, I don't know how to describe it. This first one is more like, I don't know, a springy green. This one's more Kelly green. And this one is more, um, more of a teal color. All right, so then we have... I don't know how I would use those on my eyes. Those are a little too much for me, at least these first two. But this one, I could be about that. Um, this one is Mani. Okay. It's more of a dark forest green. These have all been matte so far. They feel amazing in the pan, I have to tell you. And then this is Shay. I think I'm going to love this. Oh my God. Yeah. It's a dark green shimmer. Incredibly rich and buttery. I want that all over my face. That is amazing. Um, wow. These are cool. Um, the next color is Ash. It's like um, a black, almost black green. No, actually it's black. Um, it is the most powdery feeling of the one so far. All of the other mattes have been very, very creamy, buttery. And that shimmer was just like insane. That matte is nice too, the black. It's shiny a little bit, but, um, very silky smooth. Yeah, I would like that. I would like all of that. Um, the color Jade which is this nice spring, um, whoa, almost like a seafoam green, um, really pretty shimmer, also very smooth and buttery. And now we move into the blues. Um, Anika. This one's a little bit light in the pan, or light on the, on the skin. Um, Kind of like a sky blue. Not much to say about that. I don't know if I'd ever use that. I don't know. But I grew up thinking that blue eyeshadow on black people was kind of crazy. So, well, I don't know. Um, Mina or Mina. Ooh. This one, I wouldn't normally go for a light blue shimmer. But that one's really, really pretty. I really like that a lot. I would... I would look forward to having that on my eyes for sure. I would be all over that. There are only two blues. Oh, actually, no, there's this color Fae, which is kind of like this light steel shimmery blue metallic. Um, that's lovely too. I think it, with an inner corner highlight with these two, and maybe I'd use this blue with a little bit of the black to kind of deepen it up a little bit. But yeah, that is really, that is really pretty. Um, I've kind of run out of arm here. Let's see what I can do. Um, the last six or five colors are um, purples. Um, 
This is the color Iris. It's a lavender, a light lavender color. It's very, very pretty. It might look a little gray on camera, it looks like, but in person, it's, it's quite nice. Um, Mohan, I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. Ooh, um, very buttery and creamy in the pan. I really like their formula. Oh, that's like an electric, um, an electric purple. Yeah, that's, that is going to look beautiful. Um, camera angle lighting. Okay. So I don't know. I'm getting a blinking light. I don't know what that's going to mean. This is uh, Monique. Oh, really nice purple shimmer. I love that. That's pretty. Destiny. Destiny. Um, also, this is more of like a pinky purple shimmer. Very similar to the other one. A little bit richer in color, but a little more pinky purple. And then grain. Um, oh, wow. That is, it's kind of like this um, Mohan purple, like base color, but it's a purple shimmer. It's kind of rich in color. I really like that a lot. I think that's probably my favorite. So those, these two together will be really special. This is a really pretty palette. I, 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 it's, um. I mean, I was impressed with the video that I saw and just getting the package and opening it up. But to see it swatched, it's even better than I thought. I really like it. And I, these greens have grown on me more. So, and even this blue, I'm starting to, let me just swatch it a little bit more. Um, I think I'm going to like that blue too, although I'm not sure how I'd use it. Um, but let me try mixing the blue and the black a little bit just to get an idea. Yeah, it's got some potential. Yeah, I kind of like that. Yeah, mixing the blue and the black, for me at least, that does a little bit more. I like that more than just the, the blue by itself. All right, so that's the Hasina 2. I'm going to send this to you. And then um, I also thought, since you mentioned you like greens, I brought out the uh, Tribe palette. I don't think there's anything here that is similar. Um... Maybe this Kuba color might be similar. Um, a little bit. It's a little bit dark. It's on a black base. This one's, but this one's more blue green, and this one's more true green. And then San. I don't think that there's anything here that matches it. Um, actually, it's fairly close to this one. Um, but a little more greeny than the other one. I don't know if you can see the difference. Um, yeah. And then they have this light, this, uh, lime green in here. Um, uh, Tootsie. It is probably, yeah, it's, it's definitely a lime green, so. It looks light there, but it's, it's totally lime green on the, on the hand. And it's, it's a nice compliment to the other colors here. And, oh, and then there's this one over here, Maasai, which I guess, Maybe this is what I should call lime green. It's a like a lemon yellow green. Um, it's kind of nice. I wouldn't I wouldn't have thought I'd have liked it, but now that I see it on my hand, I do. So that's kind of interesting. The rest are golds and browns. Um, well, since I'm here, I might as well find some arm space and just do it. Um, Coro, which is this champagne. -y. Oh my God! No, it's a duochrome. So it looks uh, champagne in the pan, but when you put it on, it's this um, lime, like, green shimmer. It's really pretty. I'm happy to have that. Um, Chaga, which looks gold in the pan. Oh, yeah. That is lovely. I like that a lot. And depending on how the light hits it, it can be gold with flecks of green or... Um, like a reddish brown. It's that's that's kind of cool. 
And then speaking of reddish brown, there's a red brown shimmer called Curla. Whoa. Yeah, it's like an orange, fiery um, shimmer. My lighting, I don't think, really does it justice, but you can kind of get a feel for it. Especially, yeah, when I turn it that way, that's the true color of it. It's really nice. And then the last one is Ashanti. It's um, a greenish khaki brown. Um, very nice, very nice, a little bit drier than the others, but in terms of its color, it's, um, yeah, it's right in there. That's nice. Okay. So there you are with the greens. Thank you for watching.